Oh. My. God. No Lux Monday is back. What is going on ladies and gentlemen, AJ Good here at the House of Masks and that is right, Mailbox Monday is back in full swing. I have a fat stack of shit that's been sitting around for a minute and I am ready to unbox it. A lot of people have asked if I'm still doing this and the answer is yes, absolutely, but it only works if you mail stuff in. I know that the channel went through a weird spot the end of last year, the beginning of this year kind of, but I think that we're fully back on track. I feel more confident about the videos that I've been putting out in the past two months than I've ever felt about my content before. So yes, Mailbox Monday is back. I will open stuff when I can. So if you want to send stuff in and see your package on a Mailbox Monday, I'm going to add the information down below to have my shipping address and all that good stuff so you guys can send something in and I will unbox it on camera. Let's get started. As always, we're gonna do the envelopes first. I got some smaller envelopes right here. So let's go ahead and open this up. This is from Ivan Aragon, which is the coolest last name I've ever heard, I think. We have got a drawing here of Craig's helmet and it says, I hate AJ Good. And we have got a note and it says, Dear AJ, I've been watching your videos for some time and your collection is simply fucking badass. I love your collection and see you as an inspiration. It is really badass seeing how much dedication you put into your collection. I kind of want to get into mask collecting, but I'm a broke 14 year old, so it would be hard. My dream mask is a self-titled Craig, which someday when I have the money to get all the materials, I will make it work or I have enough money and luck to find one and buy a replica from somebody. I have encased a drawing of Craig's self-titled mask. It's not good, but it's not bad either, I think. Anyway, I hope you like it. You're super cool and a badass collector. Continue being badass. I think that the drawing looks just fine, man. I knew what it was right away. It's not like I had to struggle to figure it out. Obviously, everybody that sees this is going to know what it is. And I have no doubt about the fact that you will own a self-titled Craig one day, whether it is a replica or an original, whatever it is. Because I have stuff that I never, ever thought I would ever get and never even set out to get. So if you really put your mind to it, there's no doubt about the fact that you'll get one. I appreciate the drawing. Thank you for sending that in. On to the next one. This is from Aiden Peters. And it says, I hate AJ Good right there on the envelope. We've got, uh, we've got some, uh, Fake mustaches. I think I should probably put one on for the rest of the episode, right? Okay, now that that's taken care of, we've also got an Odd Future Donut sticker and some drawings, a Pikachu drawing, a Hello Kitty drawing, and then we finally have a note here. And it reads, Dear AJ Good, Hi, I'm a 13 year old named Aiden. I absolutely love all your videos and masks. You inspired me to collect masks. I have masks, but four of them I converted. You have one of the best mask collections ever and one of the biggest Slipknot mask collections ever. I think you are one of the funniest and best YouTubers ever. I hope one day I can have a collection as awesome as yours. I am sending you some drawings, fake mustaches, and an odd future logo. I don't know what you're talking about because this mustache is all natural. I love all of your videos and think you should do more mask conversions, but keep up the good work and hope you enjoy my little gift. Sincerely, Aiden Peters. Aiden, I enjoy your gift more than you know because nothing makes me happier than fake mustaches, so thank you very much for that. Next up, we have something from J Drop. So let's go. It's in a box. It's not like a, a envelope. This is an actual box. We're getting into the bigger stuff now. And we have... Ooh, I see a Goosebumps logo. Oh, I see more Goosebumps stuff. First up, we have a Goosebumps pen, the Haunted Mask, we have an envelope, and we have a Haunted Mask t-shirt. No shit. Well, that's fucking sick. Hell yeah. You know what's really fucking weird about this? Me and Kate were just at a mall like a week ago, and they had this shirt up at Spencer's, and they only had one size, and it was too big for me, so I couldn't get it, but I was definitely going to. That's fucking rad. And then in the envelope, we have a note that says, AJ, wow, this has taken me forever to get out to you. Just wanted to send you something originally because the time it seemed you were feeling down. You remind me a lot of my younger bro who sometimes needs encouragement to know that what he's doing may not be what everyone else wants, but ultimately will lead to personal growth and happiness. Since that time, some stuff looks like it's getting better for you, so now this is more of a congrats 
podcast. I'm sure you get tired of hearing this, but PMA is everything. I am a firm believer in manifesting your future and destiny, wishing you luck and success in all your future endeavors. Stay true to yourself and everything will follow. From Jessica, aka Blue Carolina. Thank you. I appreciate the shirt and I do appreciate the letter. That uh, That's rad. I really do appreciate that, so thank you. Oh, uh, damn it. I went out of order and I forgot that there was another fucking envelope. This is from Evan Williams. I didn't see that over there. Okay, we have a note. It says, Dear AJ Good, I hate you. No, but seriously, here are some Pokemon cards. These are pretty special to me, but I hope you enjoy them. From Evan. Well, you know that I'll enjoy them. I love Pokemon cards. Ah, uh, hell yeah. Brock's Mankey. Got a Grimer, one of my favorites. A bunch of, uh, a bunch of originals. Sandshrew. Hell yeah, man. Hey, thanks. Appreciate these. They will go good in my collection for certain. Now we have... A uh, blue package from, oh, Peter Panagram Clothing. Yeah, you follow these guys on Instagram. And it feels like a shirt, so maybe I'll have a sick shirt in here. Peter Panagram, death is the only adventure we have left. Yeah, I dig these guys' stuff, man. I've been following them on Instagram for a while. Uh, we got stickers. Woo! I fucking love stickers. We've got a shirt here that says, who the fuck is Michael Myers? We've got another shirt here that says, the blood-sucking Brady Bunch. I actually really dig that a lot. Hey, Peter Pentagram Clothing, you guys need to go check them out. Um, I totally fucking forgot that they said they were going to send me some stuff. But we've been following each other uh, back and forth on Instagram for a while, and they seem super rad, and I like the clothing that they make. So make sure to go check them out, because they seem like good dudes, and uh, I dig those shirts, so thank you very much. On to the next one, we have a box from Alex C. Martin, a.k.a. King of Pizza on Instagram. Oh, it's the first mask of Mailbox Monday's return, and it looks pretty fucking rad. Alex has sent in one of his own custom masks that he made and sculpted and painted and strapped himself. And on the inside of the mask, obviously it says, I hate AJ Good, because is a mask really a mask if it doesn't say that? We got a note here that says, Hey AJ, made this mask for you to enjoy having fun in your collection. This is one of many horror style masks that I make. If you're interested in my work, my Instagram is the King of Pizza. so make sure to go check him out if you dig this mask. Go get yourself one. I think it'd be worth it. Super, super fucking rad. I'll show this off a little bit better here at the end. But uh, yeah, it, it really does look really good. So thank you very much, Alex. I appreciate it. You know that it'll have a good home here at the House of Masks. So thank you. All right, we have two boxes left, and they are both pretty big boxes, so we will see what is in them. This one is from Dylan Johnson. That is the whitest person name I've ever heard in my life. Ooh, it's another mask. All right, I'm gonna read the note first. I have a bad habit of reading the notes last. Hello, AJ, here's the Top Stone Devil mask that I showed you. Take care of it, which I know you will. Stay awesome and stay freaky from Dylan Johnson. And then we have here, he said he found this, uh, at a thrift store and didn't really have any use for it, so he was going to send it to me, and as you can see, it's pretty fucking rad. I love old Topstone stuff. Their hair is always a dead giveaway if it's Topstone or not. It's super, super recognizable, and this one has, like, a beautiful coat of hair, so I dig it. Thank you, Dylan. I'm stoked to get all my Topstones back out, so this one will definitely make a good addition, so I appreciate it. Thank you very much for that. On to the last box, which is as big as everything else combined, and this is from... Honest to God, I have no idea how to even start pronouncing this, so let's just open it up. The outside of the box says, AJ Good has small PP, which is true, so this may be somebody that knows me. Okay, there's a bunch of stuff in here, so I'm just gonna start pulling stuff out. We've got Killer Croc Imposter Pop Vinyl. We've got Piccolo Pop Vinyl. We've got Katana. Pop vinyl. We've got a maggot mask, which I actually don't have. And man, you guys have been asking for conversion videos, and this gives me an idea. So let's see what we can make happen with that. I've never owned a maggot mask, so I'm actually pretty stoked about that. We've got a big mask in a bag, which appears to be. I think this is a paper magic group Dracula. Super fucking rad design. I really dig that, so. Yeah, Paper Magic Group, right there. This is uh, from 2005, so it's not as old as you'd think, but it definitely looks vintage. So that's rad. We've got one of those uh, 
biker masks that keep your face warm that you see at gas stations. We've got what looks to be a handmade mask out of a, like a blank white Hobby Lobby. All right, this note says, hello, I'm Avis. I'm that kid that was messaging you on Instagram. So in this box, there's three masks, a Slipknot maggot mask, a homemade mask, and a 2005 Paper Magic Group Vampire. Also contained in here is three Funko Pops. It would be nice to send a mask you find at a thrift store or something. I'll see what I can do. Also, I hate AJ Good. Look on the back of the paper. Also, I'm 12 and my birthday is on September 21st. All right, right on, man. Hey, I appreciate all the stuff. So right on, I think it was a good return to Mailbox Monday and I hope that you guys enjoyed it and I hope that it has inspired you to send me more stuff so we can keep making the episodes because people always ask if I'm still doing it and the answer is yes, but you have to send stuff in. That's how this works. So I'm gonna set out all this stuff together and let you guys take a good look at everything. I appreciate everybody that sent stuff in. Definitely means a lot. I'm glad to be back doing this. If you would like to send some stuff in, like I said before, I'm gonna put my information down below it'll have my PO box number just to go to the post office and send something if you want I'm not gonna ask you to because that's not how this works but if you do feel like sending stuff in and want to see it on an episode that's how you do it I hope that you guys enjoyed and we will see you later